1961. Yankee right fielder Roger Maris is challenging another one of Ruth's records, 60 homers in a single season. But as the season wears on, Roger wears down. Maris biographer Maury Allen recalls the chase for number 61. Roger handled the 1961 season, I think, rather well until about August. But when it became more possible that he would break this 60 home run record, you could see this emotion. You can see this wear and tear on Roger's face every day. He, he lost his hair. He was curt. He was tougher to deal with from the standpoint of the press. He tried to hide from people. He was not as accessible as he had been earlier. And people began to pry into his private life, which he hated desperately. So you could see that the emotion, the nerves, the tension, the unbearable pressures were just beginning to weigh him down. There's a drive. That might carry all the way. Bruton back. And it's number 58. Roger Maris broke Babe Ruth's record and Babe Ruth was the most heroic sports figure in American history. So the next man to come along to break Rogers' record will not have to deal with a legend. He'll simply have to deal with 61 home runs. Maris's record has since been broken, but the men who have surpassed his mark are all suspected of using performance-enhancing drugs. <laughs> 